Hello everybody, my name is Number Samurai. Welcome back to Five Nights of Candies Remastered. And I feel absolutely terrible right now. I'm sick and it's not good, but I decided to record anyways because I need to record, you know? I feel bad though, I feel terrible. Um Candies Burger and Fries. Family restaurant looking for a security guard on the night shift. 12 to 6 a.m. Monitor cameras. That's as far as I got. All right. Can't really see out the front. One. New message. All right. Hang on. I gotta move my whole keyboard. Hi. Hello. I'm the junior manager here at the restaurant. I'm supposed to walk you through the job as our new security guard. Why? Why is it doing that? Tell them you're already a well see? Guard. I'm not even touching it. Why, why my mouse drifting off? So I have to walk you through the basics anyway. All right. What's this dude saying? So let's get started. Right. We have security. I clicked off the. Key. All right, so okay, I turned it off. I stroll thing. Oh wow. Hi, hello. I'm the junior manager here at the restaurant. I'm mm -hmm. supposed to walk you through the job as our new security guard. Oh, there's captions. From your resume, I can tell that you're already a well-experienced guard. That's not. But you know it's protocol, so I have to walk you through the basics anyway. So let's get started. I am well-experienced. We have security cameras all around the restaurant. If you bring up the camera panel, you'll be able to view the feed from each camera by pressing the camera button on the mini-map. Now, our lights are always off during the night. Obviously, because it's a waste of power to leave them on all night. Mm. So to actually see something on the cameras, you can activate the camera system's night vision mode. You activate night vision by clicking on the button of whatever camera you're currently viewing. No so for example, there. say you want to see what's on camera 1. You bring up the camera panel, you click on the button that right. says cam 01, and then to use night vision, you click on cam 01 again. That noise. Once night vision is activated, click on any of the other cameras and view them with night vision as well. I got it, man. You turn it off the same way you turn it on. Mm -hmm. Now, night vision takes more power than regular vision. This so one make sure you use it sparingly. Your first priority as a security guard here is to keep an eye on the animatronics. Those are really expensive machines, and we do not want them stolen. And you keep an eye on them through the cameras. Right. We have quite a few animatronics here at Candy's. There's of course the cats Candy and Cindy. There's Chester the Chimpanzee. There's the penguins. Just lots, I tell you. Uh, so you also have three security doors in your office, each yeah. of which can be closed by pressing the door button by each door. These are here in okay. case you're in some sort of danger. But personally, I just use them to shut myself off from the world when I need a break. But don't let me be a role model on that one. You need to remember that closing these doors takes power, and the longer they're closed, the more power they drain. Yep. Now, I know that sounds kind of backwards, but you have to trust me on that one. I think it's something about the doors having an automatic fail-safe feature in case the power gets cut off, mm -hmm. you know, so they open up if there's no more power. All I know for sure is that they do use more and more power the longer they're closed, so you don't want to keep them closed for too long at a time. Now, uh, the reason I keep mentioning the power is because the restaurant uses a backup power generator at night, which only has a certain amount of juice in it. So anything from viewing the cameras to using the security doors takes power. You can see how much power you have left on the computer on the desk in front of you. Try not to run out of power. If you do, though, you won't be stuck in the office since the doors will always open up anyway. Oh, and uh, one last thing. The animatronics aren't completely turned off at night, so they might start walking around a bit. But just be careful not to let any of them into the office, because we have stuff in there we don't want damage or anything. So don't bother with the ticket booth door. They won't attempt to get in through there. That should be all. You'll hear from me yes. again on your next shift. Have a good night. Yeah, also, sorry if I'm a little bit out of it. Like I said, I am sick, and I do not feel well at all. Oh, wow, that's... That's creepy. That's cool, though. That's cool. Um, yeah. So I, I wanted to talk about this because in the in the last game we saw the dates on the calendar or whatever. That yeah. We was it this room the one that we walked in? I don't remember the first date or that many of them actually. But I'm guessing that it's the fifteenth, November the fifteenth, nineteen eighty seven. I like that music in the back. It's so quiet. I'm not sure if y'all gonna be able to hear it through the actual game, but I like it. Oh, that scared me. Oh, hey, how you doing? You looking good. My man's right there. 
Also, why don't the... What was that? Okay, why don't the doors have lights on them? I feel like that would make it a lot easier. I know it would use more power or whatever, but... Where is he? Okay. These graphics are really freaking good. Okay. Why are you looking at me like that? Uh-oh. Yeah, these graphics are really freaking good. It looks amazing. I don't have to worry about them two tonight, right? Yeah. Woo! Oh, wow. Glad I got Astros. Man. This is kind of creepy. I mean... It's not as, it's not as scary as, uh, uh, the other ones, but, you know, it's all, it's all right. They set the atmosphere, also the music cut off, and I, I want to see, like, what the date's going to be when the game ends, because I feel like that has a lot to do with the storyline, and I'm trying to figure that out as well. Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention, I'm going to go until I die again, same. The freak was that? Oh, did I hear him leave the stage? Also, I'm gonna go until I die. Shame dang is last time. Um, last time I actually beat the game, so I don't know. I never, I don't usually go until I die. So I did that one time, so I, I guess I'm gonna just start going until I die from now on because I wasn't expecting to win the actual game. So, who knows? And right when we die, the series ends. That's it. We're done. No more. Also, it's 5 a.m. 5 a.m. I don't even need the cameras tonight, I don't think. What the freak is that? What the freak is that? Okay, can I... Okay, it's really quiet. It's freaking... Hello? Hey, how you do? There she is. I am. I'm good. We good. 69 percentage is power. And it's 5 a.m. Matter of fact. Yeah, we're going to win anyways. Oh, yeah. These, even these graphics look good. Okay. November. That's November, right? No, that's not November. November is. Uh, that would be. Uh. What's before October? I forgot. I don't freaking know. I know it was September. I just couldn't think of September at the time. I'm not, I'm not feeling good. But yeah, the meat grinder. That's what that is, right? No, this is the assembly machine. Because remember, um, at the end of the last one, or at the end of uh, FNAC 3, when I was reading the, the West, whatever it was, this is the, machima, the, the assembly machine. Oh, he looks ugly. He's gonna make him mad. Yeah, this is the assembly machine for, uh... Don't jump scare me. Okay. Ah, ah I knew it was coming. I knew it was freaking coming. That's the assembly machine where, where the kid got trapped in it and died. So that sucks. Ugh, man, I don't feel good at all. I really shouldn't be doing this. Why can't you see their eyes like here? Hey there. Why don't their eyes light I, uh, up? I oh. put up a note today to gather some intel on the animatronics from the other employees. Uh, just to get a list of the uh, issues we've had with them. They bring right. down some stuff here for you. So uh, let's see. Alright, so obviously the animatronics walk around at night. You know that by now. Um, they try to get to places they shouldn't be. Uh huh. Yep. They act weird after dark. Yep. <sighs> they. Don't like adults. Hmm. I mean, I suppose they always be nice around children. Around uh -huh. us employees, they just kind of stare at you. I'm not an adult. I always thought they just hadn't been coded to interact with anyone. But with I can children. work. But some of the other employees have felt threatened by them now and then. But I know that some of them are also superstitious morons. So who wow. knows if they just became scared the animatronic looked at them in the eyes or something. 
Anyway, one last thing on the list here. The last penguin interferes with the system. There's a sentence I never thought I'd say. Uh, we have these penguin animatronics as waiters. Yeah. Uh, they take people's orders and whatnot. We used to have three of them, but two of them broke down and haven't been fixed yet. I think they're referring to the third penguin that still works, or, well, apparently it doesn't quite work. So yeah, definitely don't let him into the office. His presence alone could probably destroy our systems. Well, that'll be it for now. I'll be sure to leave Woo! the message for your next show. What was that? Oh, that's- you can barely hear him walk up. Gone. Do I only have to worry about them? Woo! I think I only have to worry about them. Alright, you freaking me out. Okay, it was Cindy. I only gotta worry about them. The, the three, I think. No, the four, because the penguin. What about the penguin? What? I was gonna say something, but I kinda forgot. I don't remember. Right, the date. The date. Okay, it's the 16th now. Alright. And the penguin's really freaking loud, right? So you can hear him? Right? I don't think I have to worry about candy without the eyeballs yet. Old candy. So we can just sit in here, right? We don't have to worry about Blink either, do we? Because once you have to start worrying about them, then it's going to get bad. It's going to get a lot harder. I really don't feel good. Also, uh, this is the office that we went in in the uh, uh, cutscenes when we were the animatronics walking around, right? And was that dude dead? Was that the dude I'm playing as right now? That dude that we saw laid out, the dead body, at the end of the... Uh, I didn't even hear you. That music going in the back. That dead body that we saw laid out in this room, was that was that the security guard that I'm playing as right now? I don't freaking know. Maybe. Yeah. This place is really, really freaking old. 1987. I didn't even hear him. I didn't even hear him. Probably because I'm speaking. Okay. Once it gets five, I'm probably just gonna close both of the doors. Cause I'm not gonna lie. What was that? Hmm. I'm not gonna lie, I gotta use the bathroom. So I'm just gonna shut both of them once it gets to five. It's five. Alright, I gotta go. Goodbye now. That was a kid getting ground up. <laughs> uh, wait, okay. How did a kid even find his way back there? No, no. All the machines, like the machines that they used to make the animatronics inside of the pizzeria. Because if they are, that is not a smart idea <laughs> to put the machines in the same building as the pizzeria. Who knows? Maybe they didn't have enough money so they had to put it on the same site. But I, I would think that would be like a hazard because like maybe a kid would wander back there and you know doesn't know what he's doing Climbs into the machine, which I guess that's what happened to him And he's not alive anymore. That's nasty. Also, I don't know who developed this game, but they did really good This looks amazing. The audio is amazing. Everything is great about this game and the entire uh, franchise of FNAC. Emule, Emule Mako? I would think they would have a team, but there's only one name 
Is there like more people that work on it? No, that's it. It's just one name. Oh, I see. Well, they did a really good job. With all that being said, I do not feel good, so I'm probably gonna go to bed. Have a ride. With all that being said, I'll be no time. I'm out. See you guys next time.